岡機動隊のフォームメート日本目の監督をした押井守といいます。押井 who made the anime came to visit us in production to see that world imagined. It's pretty spectacular. The scale of it is so baked in from the beginning. It's very true to the anime. Rupert is really a visionary. Got it there? Very good. Thanks, Scarlett. Scarlett, she's incredible. It's great to start from something that inspires you. This experience has been like nothing else I've ever had before. Scarlett and Hansen, the most of all, we can talk to the side of the team. 僕は想像した以上に役になってると思う。間違いなく今まで作られた合格の中で一番ゴージャスな作品になると思う。We've created a universe that people haven't seen before. So what do you think of the live action version of Ghost in the Shell? Now the title was first published back in 1989 by one of the largest Japanese publishing companies, Kodansha, and it has since generated three anime movies, an anime TV series, and three video games. Attempts to get a live action Ghost in the Shell film off the ground have been going on for years, ever since DreamWorks and Steven Spielberg acquired the rights back in 2008. In that time, multiple producers, writers, and even actors have come and gone, with the studio struggling to properly green light The picture, probably not helped by the not so good track record for live action anime adaptations. Do you think Scarlett Johansson was the right choice for the role? There's certainly been some heated debate on this topic. Margot Robbie was firstly considered for the lead role, however, negotiations broke down and the role was offered to Johansson. And it does seem that the character was tailor made for Johansson from her voice acting role in her to her butt kicking heroines. It seems like all her steps have been leading up to this. The great thing about Ghost in the Shell is that, like many adaptations, it already has a built in audience with the right mix of elements, mainly action, sci fi, and sex appeal, to also bring in fresh viewers. So let me know your thoughts. Do you think the movie will be a success? Leave your comments below and remember to keep it tuned to Filmies Now for all the latest movie trailers.